you guys. Happy Friday. If you have been following us uh, the last couple of weeks, you might know that we have the new FlySight 2 available and ready to ship. Today we're going to unbox it and we're going to do a, a small comparison between FlySight 1 and the FlySight 2. Uh, so just get, let's get to it, flip the camera and check it out. All right guys, welcome back. So FlySight 2 is already out. We uh, we have them in stock and ready to ship. We also have the uh, original FlySight, the FlySight 1 available until we run out of them. Uh, and then it's all the FlySight 2. So we have both versions available and ready to ship. If you want to place the order online, I have a link down in the description where you can find those. So let's flip the camera, let's unbox the FlySight 2 and let's do a little comparison in between the two of them. Uh, what comes in the box, what advantages and what upgrades they made on the fly side too. Hey, do me a favor, click that like button, subscribe and hit the bell to get our latest notifications. It really helps our channel grow. Thank you. All right, so here we got fly side two. It's a complete new redesign build up of uh, basically the platform of the uh, fly side one. Uh, and it starts with all the original features with a real time audible feedback using tones and speech. Uh, you can review the data after jumps uh, the same applications you use with, uh, use with the FlySight 1. Um, it includes new features. Uh, you have a more powerful, uh, powerful processor, uh, Bluetooth, low energy radio, uh, improved audio quality, uh, additional sensors for acceleration, rotation, orientation, pressure, humidity, and temperature. It's water resistant, and it has a USB-C interface. So, what's in the box? You get your start guide, how to configure, power up, and all that good stuff. You have the mount installation, which I'll show you how to use that. It's a little bit tricky, but it's pretty cool. It actually comes with actually comes with a mount. With the uh, FlySight One, you did have to get a separate mount for it, but this one, as you can see here, it comes in the box ready with a mount. And this mount. Uh, is um, it's basically contoured to the uh, whole unit and it will uh, attach to pretty much all um, helmets with a curvature of uh, 110, 110 degrees. Um, it, mo it will fit most helmets with that curvature. Uh, but it will fit in any of the previous mounts of the Flyside 1, like the Cookie Flyside mount, this will fit in there or the other uh, aluminum uh, Bionic Avionics uh, aluminum mm, fly side mounts. So here you got your power button, your USB-C, and a looks like it's a stereo jack. What else is in the box? So underneath this little piece of cardboard, you have the mounting hardware and sticky uh, pads this basically goes underneath when you mount this to your helmet this goes in uh, underneath the shell of the helmet so it sandwiches in between the shell and the unit so it comes with that obviously you got your charging cable and of course we're skydivers we need a bottle opener so that's what's in the box with the flight side 2 uh really cool unit Let's go over how to take it off of the mount and put it back in. This is how you basically push the fly side two out of its mount. You have a little tab here and you have this little, um, like a button down below. You just pull this towards the back and push it up. And this is how it releases. So it snaps into place. There you go, you got all the information, you got the serial number, and this is what the mount looks like. So you have these two little um, grooves there that go into these right here. So it secures like so, and then snap into place, and that's it. All right, fly side two and fly side one which uh, again they are in stock until we run out of them you get your quick start guide you get the actual unit which if you can see here they're similar in size uh, fly side 2 obviously is a little bit thicker a little bit fatter but similar in size again reminder 
the fly side two, uh, the fly side one does not fit on the new mount, but the fly side two has the same footprint and it will fit on the previous mounts, like the cookie um, fly side mount and all the aluminum uh, mounts. Then you have your charging cable, and that's pretty much it. With the uh, fly side one, you have a built-in rechargeable lithium polymer battery. Uh, charging time is about probably one and a half to two hours. Operating time is about two and a half to three hours. Uh, with the uh, fly side two, that's improved a bit. You get a faster processor uh, and uh, better uh, sensors with acceleration, rotation, orientation, pressure, humidity, and temperature. Uh, so you get more precise and faster readings with the two compared to the previous version. Like I said before, the curve of the bottom, uh, bottom curve of the mount is 110, 110 degrees, uh, which will fit most helmets. Uh, unfortunately, it was not possible to produce a new mount for, you know, different curvatures. But uh, I know that they're working on probably a 3D printed spacer that will go in between the uh, bottom of the uh, mount onto the, the, the your helmet shell to match different curvatures. So that's probably coming in the near in the near future. But in the meantime, this will work with any 110 to 110 curvature uh, helmets. To review the data, you can use the same uh, applications that you used to uh, download and review data with the FlySight 1. You can use the same with the FlySight 2. Well, guys, there you have it. FlySight 2 is available and ready to ship at shootingstar.com. If you wish to place an order, link in the description below. And we still have FlySight 1 in stock if you wish to go with the previous versions. There are also some uh, available for you to order. All right, so that's it for today. That's the FlySight 2. We do have them available and ready to ship. Link down in the description where you can find them uh, and order yours today.